Americans of Association Taiwan, while he has uh, actively participated in the women workers movement and the women's movement, as well as the, the uh, lesbian, gay, queer, and transgender movement in Taiwan since the late 1980s until the very present. She, um, she has fought heroically um, for the rights of gender, sexuality, minorities on all fronts in Taiwan and is the principal architect of Gender and Sexuality Rights Association Taiwan um, as the Secretary General. Um, in recognition of her work um, for the women's and the LGBT human rights um, struggles in Taiwan on November 19th, 2002, she was, um, she received, um, she, she became one of the 14 um, Taiwan, uh, Taipei citizens to, to be awarded um, the distinguished um, title of honorary, honorary citizen of Taipei City commemorative badge. Um, in 2003, she also won uh, one, of four, um, uh, one of the four Utopia Awards um, in Bangkok in recognition of her long-term contribution to Taiwan's uh, lesbian and gay human rights struggles. And she also won a Philippa Award in 2004. Ching Ryong um, is um, GISRAT's um, LGBT News Agency Director, and she has participated in the women's movement as well as LGBT uh, movement in Taiwan since the early 1990s. Um, she has always been uh, the main uh, strategist uh, and script writer for all of these um, um, action drama, or what we call Xidongju drama action events um, for GISRAT. She's also a, a director and translator for LGBT news agency, which began on June 22nd, 2000, and its, um, its subscribers um, include activist groups, cultural workers, gay rights scholars, and university professors. <laughs> one people speak, sorry. One people speak in Chinese and we'll try to do translation as fast as possible so we can all go to lunch. Okay. I would like to talk about three things. One is how do we come about uh, participating in this movement. Two is the nature of the movement. And three is what we plan to do in this movement. <笑>那在民主运动的时期从戒严到解严走过了公运复运到现在的同志运动戒严之后到现在新政府上台了我们的新政府是说我是人权立国的所以大家就会认为台湾现在是进步的是自由的相对于中国大陆不过我们观察到
的指纹建档。第二，目前有个分级制度管理我们的图书。这个分级制度会使得有一些出版品因此会被查禁，也就是我们要有禁书了。嗯、另外一个是我们有一个 IC 健保卡，就是所有所有国民的每一个国民的健康资料是收集在一个 IC 卡上的。还有一个是跟中国大陆有关的，只有中国大陆嫁到台湾的新娘要经过一个特殊的叫面谈制度，而且他们取得台湾国籍的年份。在延长当中，跟其他的外国是不一样的。还有一个也跟各位有关，如果你们要来台湾工作，包括 Peter， 如果你要去找工作的话，现在外国人来台湾工作签证要经过健康检查。To give you some examples of our human rights state, one、uh, fingerprinting system will be on since July this year. Every citizen of Taiwan will have fingerprinting on file and with the state. Two, there is a、uh, rating system they erected for all print material, which means, in matter of fact, that we will have a censorship system whereby certain materials, sexually explicit or violent materials, will not be able to be published.、Um, people who supply those materials will be、uh, will suffer from huge fines and also a prison sentence. Three, we now have a, a healthcare card in which. All our new policy that applies only to to men and women who are now married into、uh, Taiwan,、uh, they now have to go through the sort of interview system that you also directed for foreign brides.、Uh, very strict interviews that pry into your private sex lives, and the waiting period of brides has been extended from eight years to eleven years. You have to wait for at least eleven years. To get a citizen's card, and lastly, any foreigners now into Taiwan for employment purposes will have to be subjected to health exams. And in our university, we had an applicant who applied for our teaching job.、Uh, he is HIV positive, and we were not able to recruit him at all. That's a good. 所以现在也是没有办法接受的例子。呃，再补充两个，我刚忘了提，还有一个是青少年，我们有十二点以后不能在外面乱走，会受罚，叫做宵禁。我想各位已经不是青少年了，听得懂中文的都知道，这是很可怕的事。我有青少年的宵禁，还有就是刚刚杜聪有讲的，就是 Internet 对于我们运动上的可能发展性有一个危机，是我们将要在今年七月还是对，要对我们的 Internet 进行同样的禁书的检查。So, in the future, maybe you can't find our website. Mm-hmm. Two more examples.、Uh, at least in Taipei City, there is a very clear、uh, midnight curfew for anybody under the age of 18. So, if any teenagers were found in the streets after midnight, parents or guardians will suffer、uh, some kind of punishment. And also, starting July of this year, there will be an internet rating system. In accordance with the Child Welfare Act that I mentioned yesterday, the rating system will practically censor all、uh, sex-related、uh, information. And because of this general universal、uh, application of the system, you might not be able to see many of the sites that probably bear the domain name of sex something, including the sex center. So, we are doing the movement. 对我而言，或对我们的同伴，包括陈勇、李嘉珍啊，我们认为这是一个不能放弃的、必须不断进行、不能停止的一个斗争的场域。也就是说，运动不会结束，因为我们得到了某一个权益。在这样的一个所谓的没有办法真正落实人权的国家里，如果是国家的话，我们必须不断的进行运动。<笑> Uh, based on the above observations, for us activists at GS Rats, there seems to be no end to our struggles, because we live in a state, if we could call it a state,、uh, where human rights has no firm、uh, protection. So there's really no end to our struggle. We have to continuously go on fighting. 好，接下来讲一下我们运动的内涵哦。我们在一九九八年历经一个很大的转变。我们过去真的真的在一个妇女团体工作，是一个妇运团体。我们离开了它，因为我们看到一个现实：这样一个团体在台湾越来越主流、狭隘、拥抱国家、不加思考的。我们决定离开，当然我们也是被赶出去的
，我做对我自己好的说法。然后我们开始了现在一个所谓的性权运动，包含了对弱势性别，包括同志跨性别以及性工作、艾滋等等的运动。这个运动我们连接了各种不同的在台湾的对抗压迫的运动。那我等一下举些例子。Now we move on to the second section of my report in relation to the nature and the history of this group. In uh, previously, before 1997, we belonged to women's groups, but we have noticed that this, uh, uh, these women's groups are now moving very, very mainstream, very narrow on their views and loving the state. Um, and when they are state-oriented, um, their policies and directions have changed and we were practically thrown out in 1997 and we initiated our sex rights oriented movement building alliances and articulating minority oriented movements on all 自由的运动, 还有包括性工作除罪, Right now, our work includes the protection of personal uh, information, privacy-oriented, including what I've talked about uh, in relation to the IC healthcare card and also the fingerprinting system, resisting uh, uh, both uh, measures. And also, we are working for freedom of speech in relation to the rating systems regarding print material and also web material. We also work toward decriminalization of sex work and also the liberalization of surrogate mothering and the list goes on. And if you're interested, we have a longer paper describing that. We probably have our brochure in your hands, so uh, take a minute and look at it. 这些运动我们都认为跟同意是必须连接，而且是必须同时进行的。同志运动对我们而言，它不是一个身份认同的运动，它是一个必须不断扩大社会压缩空间、改变压迫体制、对抗集权管控的一个运动。And um, for us, all the above mentioned movements are closely related to the gay and lesbian movement and must be carried out at the same time. As Judith Butler had mentioned yesterday, uh, we, and we concur on that, the gay and lesbian movement in our eyes is not an identity movement, not a movement centered upon a narrow bunch of people, but works to open up rigidifying social space and to fight a totalitarian uh, social atmosphere. 因为在台湾我们知道如果你做一个弱势者你不是个女的,你是个男的,你干嘛穿个女人的内裤,他可以这样进行。We have noticed that in Taiwan, if you are a marginal minority, there is no privacy guaranteed for you. We've had cases where our a transgender friend who wears a women's underwear inside uh, male clothing were uh, spot-checked by the police, and the police found out that the guy was wearing women's underwear, and the police would call on the media, there's a certain collaboration between the two, and the media will come and shoot the man with his pants down and clothes off to show that he's a pervert. And these uh, severe cases of human rights violation have taken place very quite, quite often in Taiwan these years. This is why personal protection is very important and related to the same. Another one is freedom of speech. 言论自由在台湾因为解严之后我们解严的只有政治言论而且是部分的如果你有权利你的政治言论被保障但是跟性言论有关的完全被打压有一个很显著的例子在我右边的受害者可是他是幸运的受害者因为他赢了那个case另外
Uh, another area where I've talked about the protection of privacy, another area that we're working very closely upon is the uh, protection of freedom of speech. In Taiwan, although we have lifted martial law, the liberalization of speech relates only to the political realm and it also depends on where you stand on political issues. In relation to sexual speech, there is no freedom, there is no respect and no protection. Uh, my own case has already been talked about yesterday. I was lucky one because I won the case. Uh, right now, the gay bookstore Jing Jing's case is still in court and we are uh, fearful that it will probably be found guilty uh, within a week, and uh, but we will still continue uh, fighting for this case. Uh, for the past two days, we've been talking about the incriminations of human rights case in relation to gays, as if the lesbians were safe. But actually, there is one case in Taiwan. Last year, on Valentine's Day, uh, there's a, a lesbian program, a radio program that's broadcasted at 11 o'clock. And in that uh, program, they have a segment that teaches about lesbian safe sex. And that segment, because they were talking about lesbian sex, was fined by the Information Bureau. So, we that is why for the past few years, GSRAT has been working toward making uh, sex rights an integral part of human rights. Because right now in Taiwan, the conception of human rights does not include anything related to sexuality. And we have been working very hard to articulate various social movement groups in pursuit of human rights and making them also understand that sex rights is part of human rights. 好, 講到未來, 快, 我們現在的戰鬥哦, 其實就是小何, 这两件事情必须一起来看为什么是危机那这个台语的新闻播报在同志可能就是个人就是我对你有偏见你这个同志我对你有意见将来未来我们会看到已经发生了有一个趋势因为这个法制保守化的趋向使得对同志的压迫将会是制度性的不是人与人之间的 OK, let's talk about future, except the third segment of my report. Right now, what we're faced with is a, an increasingly conservative uh, government uh, influenced by uh, very, very conservative groups. And the conservative NGOs now have access to the center of power in the state. So every time a new law is put into place or uh, amended, it will be tending toward the conservative side. And that creates a huge crisis for us. So far, the uh, existence of the gay or lesbian culture has been almost invisible, despite movement efforts. Invisible meaning in, in the cultural aspects, for example, in the Taiwanese dialect, which is now the prevalent and official uh, language, there is no reference to sexuality. No vocabulary exists to describe the sex act, except in the most vulgar sense. There was one case whereby um, there was a case involving oral sex and a female anchor woman was supposed to read the news and in, Chinese, in Taiwanese 
And in Taiwanese, there's no word for oral sex. So she resorted to the sucking on the testicles or balls, making it a very, very vulgar description. So as you can see, anytime you want to mention the sex act in the Taiwanese that dialect, uh, you will have to be thrown into the vulgar area. So when, when sex is not included in the language, uh, it's considered that the uh, gay presence will be uh, totally <coughs> invisible. And when nowadays, when the conservative groups work on the institution of new laws or amendments of old laws, since they come from a very conservative uh, position, the existing prejudice or discrimination will now be formalized into the legal uh, terms and making discrimination a structural constraint rather than just a cultural prejudice. It's now legal. Jiliya 让这些执法的人能够更容易地进行人权的侵害，比如说在临检的时候，刚刚的例子，以及我们听到的，包括小何，包括静静的起诉的案件。To give you an example, uh, individual police officers or prosecutors or judges may harbor prejudice against gays or lesbians or other sexual minorities, and they may apply it in their uh, job-related cases and may incur human rights violations. But nowadays, with new laws in place, the existing personal prejudices could be expressed in a very legitimate way through the execution of these laws, making these human rights violations not only easy, but also legitimate. 所以在台湾我们面对的问题其实不是颜色的问题因为台湾现在颜色是疯狂的也就是说台湾现在有点颜色混乱可能跟什么政府也无关我们八月也有一些共同策划人在现场I am probably against the existing government or for a certain political position. But I think in dealing with marginal uh, uh, movements, we're not dealing with party politics because all parties now, as I can see, are quite conservative in their tendencies. In, in Taiwan, I had an experience one day, I was carrying an umbrella which was blue, and blue, and blue stands for the KMT color and I was passing through the Presidential Palace of Taiwan where they were holding a green uh, activity, green related to the DPP ruling party, and I felt very uneasy, wondering whether I was going to be attacked because I was holding a, a blue umbrella walking through a green crowd. 
and in Taiwan, the politics has been polarized very dramatically in the past few years. But I think uh, whether it was blue or green, whether it was Bush or the other, Kerry or whatever, whether it was in Hong Kong or elsewhere, we're faced with the same kind of tendency toward conservatism. I'm not so sure whether you elected a different president, you will get a different politics, because right now we're faced with the same kind of uh, closing up of social space. In August, uh, GS Rat will host uh, a, the first Asian and lesbian film festival in Taipei, and we're hoping to uh, build some kind of alliance and also carry on discussions among regional delegates and try to create and uh, move toward a general uh, direction in which we could work together in, resistant, in resistance of this kind of conservative regime. Uh,一个是连接,另外一个是我们可以想谈同运的自我扩大,就是说同运绝对不是身份认同的运动,因为像刚刚周聪也提到,就是他在做interview的时候, 他们问到就是使用保险套的比例，其实，在台湾我们也面临同样的问题。可是我们问了一个问题，我们知道有一个答案，我们必须面对，也就是不是他用或不用，是个人的问题而已，也就是不只是我们教育可以达到一个目的，
more comments uh, or, or a question you can you can respond. I'm a little bit uncomfortable about uh, you know. First of all, I want to make it clear that I don't deny uh, the importance of AIDS uh, prevention education uh, in the contemporary uh, gay community in China. Um, I think it's very important, but I want to emphasize um, the uh, uh, problem of uh, uh, HIV uh, um, uh, prevention or uh, AIDS prevention um, in China have a very different dynamic. And uh, uh, actually, uh, the, at the beginning of the breakout of AIDS problem is for the people who are drug abuser and for people who are infected because of uh, uh, their out of their poverty, they have to sell their blood and uh, you know in, in, <coughs> infected by, by this uh, kind of way of uh, um, uh, um, uh, transmission and. Uh, I think uh, the uh, gay men as, uh, I mean, gay sex as a way of transmitting uh, 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 HIV um, is not the uh, most important issue, you know, in the big picture. And, uh, 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 you know, as I said, I don't deny the importance of, uh, of doing uh, this kind of education. And, uh, and uh, I think, you know, for, for China, people need knowledge of uh, uh, AIDS because most people don't even tell the difference between HIV positive and the full blown AIDS. Just you know, if someone has it positive, oh, he is he is, he is having AIDS. I think you know that's the very I mean those kind of information may need at least passed down. And uh, for this analogy between like uh, 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 United States in early 80s and uh, you know and this moment in China. Uh, I'm not very sure uh, about this. And also in terms of the internet, I mean, all those uh, 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 historical works uh, um, written on, on um, like gay community or you know, people even before, uh, you know, we have gay politics, we all know uh, gay men or uh, queer people always uh, have their way of creating their own social spaces uh, in which they can uh, have sexual uh, interact, they can either perform their identity or uh, doing their things <coughs> of their own uh, sexual persuasion. So, uh, uh, Taiwan女中组织蛮多的现在,就90年开始有一个正式集结的叫我们之间 college, university,都一定有同志的学生团体 然后他们会分男同志团体跟女同志团体,所以都有女同志的学生团体 然后女同志的学生团体他们自己会组成一个叫做NULA 然后他们现在每年都会办运动会那当然像同志这群热心派像我们我们会办一些文化的活动像讲座或者是音展这一类也就是说各个城市都有然后可是你讲到组织的话是我讲的这一种可是还有就是每一个城市大概都有 你走在路上,你看一看,大概就知道你该进这家店,就会跟你聊聊天,就是相认,所以各个城市都有,所以你们去的话,就是可以把这个线拉一拉。
，对，最好是两个人一块去，表示一下彼此有个这样的动作，可以跟你相认。<笑>